Go, 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 go. Yeah, see, they're suppressed. Go, flamethrowers! What do you, you... You guys have flamed... Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Let me get a little closer. The French have brought something spicy for you. Come here. Come here! No, don't surrender! I want to burn you! I lied about my age and joined up when I was 17. Looking back, I was just a foolish boy looking for glory on the battlefield. All right. I'm not going to read all this. I just want you to be 100% aware because there is a fuck ton of writing in this tutorial, so I'm not going to read all of it. These are the units you actually move around. So you can move around, you know, different infantry. You've got the air, uh, to air wing there. You've got the tank battalion. Uh, then you've got buildings you can upgrade here. That's like a supply depot. These are regional abilities. So we grab our three American boys and we march them over to here. There is no animation for that. They just kind of slide. Now, this is something I do quite like. Uh, the allied forces have to deal with disunity of command. Basically, there's three groups. Britain, Canada, Australia, India. They're group one. France is group two and America is group three. If you put those units together as infantry, they suffer a minor morale penalty. The central powers don't have that problem. Uh, when it comes to, uh, what do you call it, artillery though, you can have like, siege artillery of the French support the Americans and that's fine. We are under attack. So, cool, 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 cool. Yes, 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 cool, cool, cool. Engage battle. All right. So, this is the trench building and the defense setup. So trenches stick around between battles, but uh, barbed wire and such doesn't. So I'm going to put a trench to there and then put one to there. Oh, if I could... Sir, you are in the... I can't actually move my fucking camera while you're... Sir! You're the reason why your fucking country's getting invaded, all right? Uh, support structures. Now, this is really important. MG nests. These are incredibly important. Oh my god, I still can't move this thing. Anyway, so the way this works, you got your infantry here. You can swap them around like so. There you go. They can swap positions on the, uh, on the trenches, right? They are companies of 225 men each. Uh, oh god, I can't actually- I'm not even allowed to do anything until the fucking tutorial pisses off! Yes, cool. Okay, raise balloons. We send up the balloons. I do quite like this. Sending up the balloons is really cool. You send up the balloons and... Dun dun dun. There you go. Spotting enemy territory now. And we can look down into their trenches and see them. Now, the artillery is quite cool. You've got different types you can use as well. Light artillery can do, like, uh, creeping barrages and such. But, uh, when someone's in a trench, artillery doesn't do much to them. The good thing it does, when that, see that little circle symbol? That means they're suppressed, so they won't be firing. That's really important to use against machine guns. The Germans are going over the top! Huzzah! Now watch this. Look at how many un units are coming at us. Look at all of these enemies. Now watch this machine gun. Wait for it. And one company wiped. Two companies wiped. Three, four, five, six, seven. And mind you, this is two machine guns. Oh, the rifles are joining in. Eight, nine, ten. Yeah, you are. Your guys die fast fast when they're out of trenches. If you are out of a trench, you have about 0.2 seconds of life. Well, there you go. That was the entire German attack. Oh, and now they're going to uh, bombard the machine guns, of course. See, if they'd done this during the attack, they could have suppressed the machine guns whilst those guys pushed. And now, we bring in this. And they're fucked. <laughs> There you go. Check this. Hey! Victory! More aircraft. Go! Did those just fucking hover out of the darkness? I saw that. Nice. Oh my god! No! So many Americans just died. The game's different. I don't know yet if it's really good yet. You know, I need to obviously play it a bit more. Learn how it's, you know, learn how it's going to play. Yada, yada, yada. But... I kind of like it. Uh, I like this. So instead of ending battles, you know, battles don't just end when something happens. Battles end when a ceasefire is called. So you either have to, you can deny the ceasefire and be like, no, 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 I'm going to keep fighting you because I want to like kill you. Uh, or you can go, yeah, we'll accept the ceasefire. But I just, I really quite appreciate how this, oh my God. Oh my God. Look at their casualties. Oh, we then open up the research tree. We then 
look around here. So there's different branches. You've got trench, uh, engineering, logistics, flight, infantry, and intelligence. And uh, what I do like is they're actually all kind of interconnected. So you can see artillery feeds into uh, logistics here, you know. Uh, but we're going to get death from below. Unlocks the ability to perform an undermining attack in field commander battles. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, there's like a fucking town. Oh, shit. I wonder if that actually, that's like going to work. Support structures. Undermining. Oh, dear. All right, sure. Pre-battle bombardment. We're going to add plus. Let's see. Oh, so we, we have to spend a certain amount on uh, on siege artillery, and that then gives us a percent chance to destroy trenches. Oh, okay. So our our pre-battle artillery destroyed three comm trenches and an improved firing trench. And oh boy, look where our undermine is. All right. Oh my god. Undermine. Well, I don't want to detonate it now. Fine. Fuck it, I guess. It says observe the fucking explosion. Oh, come on! Fuck you, tutorial! Fuck you! I wanted to see the cool explosion! Right. Oh my god, I can move again. Wow, that's a big hole! Alright. Oh my god, the explosion of Americans! Now, rolling barrages. Let's get one of these here to cut my uh, cut my way through this barbed wire. There we go. And uh, then we want to try this one here. Do the same. The attack wave prepares themselves. All right, grab the tanks. Target the blockhouse with the CG artillery. Grab the heavy field artillery. Oh my god, Siege Artillery's good! Alright. Oh, oh. Look at that, that's just rifle fire. All oh, those raiders are already wiped. Okay. Push this way a bit more, guys. Come on. Because I'm about to call in intense fire on every position that's suppressing my boys. Okay. Go. Go, 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 go. Yes, yeah, see, they're suppressed. All right, go, 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 go. Please, flamethrower and succeed. Go. Go, flamethrowers. Guys, what are you, what are you, you, you guys have flamed. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I see why they were banned. Oh, oh, there's a full-blown brawl in here. Send the flamethrowers in! Hold on. Oh no! No, they've just gotten in and started punching as well! I was thinking they were going to use the flamethrowers. <laughs> Let me get a little closer. The French have brought something spicy for you. Come here. Come here! No, don't surrender! I want to burn you! <laughs> Flambe. I really like this. This is good fun. Like, this is actually, they've made World War One combat genuinely good fun. I'm impressed at how good this is. The location is secure. Lovely. They request to surrender. During battle, they can offer a surrender when they feel it's lost. It will give the attacker control of all the control points, resulting in a great victory. Huh. I can choose to deny their surrender? I have nothing more to teach you. Well done. You're ready for challenges. Try oh, try out the full campaign. Yes! Ah, so I see. It's like... There's a timer on the demo, but we do actually get to play the demo! Oh, thank god, it's not just stuck in tutorial! Yes! Oh, I really want to try the Brit tanks. So maybe, maybe we make a push out of Belgium. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. But all right, let's just try move these guys over. Jesus! All right, that's an army and a half. All right, so we need to give them one turn to recover, and then army intel. So what does it show us? Oh, they're weak. They're weak. A big push can push through. What do we got? Central powers, what are they attacking with? So we, we know they're coming with seven cores, but we don't know what they actually are. Most likely outcome is major loss. All right, let's go. So what have I got? I've got three units of artillery, three units of light artillery, three flamethrowers, three raiders, 60 infantry. So we just need a bunch of machine guns then. Machine guns out the ass. Okay, two machine guns on the left. That should just be solid. 
One machine gun here to cover the middle, just in case they try and co uh, cross this forest. One here. One here. Okay, that leaves us with enough for either some barbed wire or a field mortar, or honestly, I think it's worth it just to pump out loads more infantry. All right, begin the battle. Let's go. Let's see. Oh my god, those guys are close. Uh oh. It begins. They're attacking the right flank. Oh. Oh, it's going to be a massacre. Hello, boys. Oh. Oh, it's disgusting. I love it. Ah, beautiful. Oh, fuck. They're actually going to storm it. They're going to make it in. All right, boys. Get out of here. Pull back to the next line. Holy shit. There are so many Germans. I need by time, by time, go. Come on. Yes, okay, they're all suppressed. Good. Okay. Big trench battle up there. Those guys can buy time for me. Oh, fuck. It's a German bomber. Retake. Okay, you guys are pretty wounded. I'm gonna get you to withdraw out of the combat. Holy shit, we weathered the attack. That was insane. Hey, what if I... <laughs> yes, I think I'll take your ceasefire. I was gonna go attack their trenches, but you know what? I think I'm good. I think I, uh... I should not have survived that, and I did. We're going straight in an Udnard. Looks like we'll engage. We're going to have the total available supply of 3,900. God damn. Max supply draw. Okay. All right. Let's go. Okay. This is interesting. Why does this feel like an open battle? I mean, I assume I have to, like, you know, fortify my side and all that, but, like, this is a, a weird scenario. Put down the cannon tank. MG tank. Looks good. We'll lead with Gurkhas. Uh, and then... British infantry. Oh, there's elite British infantry as well. Alright, hell yeah. Let's see. Heavy field artillery at the back. Machine guns, but not that many infantry. Okay. That, however, is a fortified position if I've ever seen one. My god. I mean, they don't have any machine guns, so I could probably storm the south side. Uh, let's call in some Gurkhas. And then some more elite infantry. And we're going to try a storming action here. Oh, 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 we're getting hit with artillery over here. Oh, fuck! Wow! Okay, artillery fucking wiped my tanks. Go! Come on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Guys! Guys! Oh, fuck. They're getting cut up by artillery. Okay, go. Storm the position. Come on! I believe you guys get in the trench. Go! Thank you. Oh, what? what's going on over here? What the fuck? I see. I see. Okay. Well, I've lost a field artillery. Fuck. Okay, they're dead. They're winning that trench, at least. That... Tr fuck. Okay, we took one trench. Nice. Uh, not exactly what I need, but we can break through from here. All right, rolling barrage. Get into the trenches, boys. Go, 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 go. Yes. All right. Here we go. We're breaking through. And all it took was a lot of men. Nice work. All right. The hill has been taken. Oh, that is, uh, at what cost? <laughs> Come on. Come on, Light Artillery. Can you do enough damage to kill that? Come on. Yes, you can. Champion. Go. Go. Oh, my God. I might have actually pushed through. Come on. Let's get into that trench. Go, 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 go. Yes. Beautiful. All right. The second wave! Woo! All right, that was a good attack. Like, that went way better than the first attack, honestly. Wow! My god! Go. Oh my god, we seized the blockhouse. I can seize the command trench! Go! This is it. This is it. Yes! Ah, oh, we've got 35 seconds. I don't think we'll capture it in time. But god, that's cool. Oh wait, no, the timer's stopped. Oh! <gasps> No, I'm gonna get a fucking- I'm gonna get a full sweep here. Come on, what do we get? Oh! 
Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, we uh we lost 7,000 men, several tanks, some artillery. But they lost more. They lost uh well, at least more in points. All right. Global supply spent 100. So there's now Okay, so as we can see, uh they're down to a single star on that point. So we reduce them from two stars to one. We take one more star, we capture the location. Uh all right. Can we get chlorine gas now? Yeah. Yeah! All right! Now, check this out. Here you go. Our trenches from the last battle are here still. And so it- wait, why did they re-seize the terrain? Okay. That I'm less keen on. Because I seized those at the last battle, right? I kind of thought it would be like, I would be in these and we move on further. I don't know. Hmm. The first wave we send in is going to just be basic Brits. And the intent is that if they die, they die. Who cares? Oh, yeah. You know what? If I could undermine his trench and just blow up this side. Yeah, baby. All right. Oh, that is a good position for the mine. Oh, we can seize position X with pretty much ease, I think. All right, let me try out the gas. Damages infantry over time. Okay. Go. Ooh. Is he actually taking damage? It's hard to tell. But let's start with this. So, here's what we do. We hit this left side with suppression. We drop smoke, oh, sorry, gas under him. Hopefully that'll work. Fuck it, bombing run under this guy. And... Boop! Oh my god! In we go, gentlemen! Oh, MG's tearing me up, but we're getting in, we're getting in. Nice. They're actually getting suppressed. Come on, guys. Oh, shit, my bomber showed up. Incredible work there, bomber. Oh, oh, hey, get out of the gas, guys. Get out of the gas. That's our gas. Ow. Can you target them? There we go. Nice, a little field mortar as well. Look at this. Arkin shots in. Are you able to hit those guys in there, or are they just invincible right now? Are you able to kill them? Hello? There's, there's definitely enemies here. Please kill them. Oh, okay, we've decided we're allowed to fight again. Oh my god! Oh my god! Alright, the position is mine. Alright, looking good, looking good. Alright, looks nice. We're seizing that right side as well. Yes, god, the Gurkhas make quick work of them in the trenches. Wow, that's definitely a, uh, a mix of infantry losses there. Yeah, I lost a, I lost a, got a lot of boys, but... Uh, damn, they lost a lot as well. That is a great victory. There we go. God damn, that's good. Like, I, I'm keen to see the full campaign when it drops. That was just a fun game. Many would strive for a long-lasting peace so that no war of such devastating scale should ever exist again. Yet, with great sorrow, history would tell a different story. And that's the last war humanity ever fought.